Girls between the lines in three, two, one, go. And we are ready for qualification match number 11 over here on the Curie Field. Already we have a Blue Alliance robot getting a hash panel up on the third level. That is incredible for this level of play, but also expected. It's champs. 1360, unfortunately, earning a penalty because they crossed the line. 2056, not playing around. They've already got two hatch panels on the lower level of their robot, or of their rocket, excuse me, and now they're working on the cargo. They've quickly got one, two in. OP Robotics is no stranger to, to success, but they also have the work and the ethics to back it up. They've got another hatch panel on the rocket for the Red Alliance. Meanwhile, 3102 and 1360 are just playing defense on each other, going back and forth, trying to distract each other from the offense that they are trying to be playing. 401 Copperhead Robotics coming over. They're working on placing a cargo into the ship for the Blue Alliance. 1501, one of our Indiana teams here this weekend, they have also, they're also working on getting a cargo into the ship for Blue. 2056 OP Robotics, they have level one of the rocket done. They have level two of the rocket done. Now they're working on level three. Looks like 3656 is having some issues communicating and 3102 is over on the other side of the, of the field playing offense, but 2056 is doing enough work for an entire alliance. They almost have an entire rocket done just by their own merit. Blue Alliance has three, three robots working on offense, and they've not been able to get a rocket like 2056 was just able to do. We have 35 seconds left in the match. 3102 is still duking it out, playing defense up against 1501. Team Thrust from Indiana. Meanwhile, over on the Blue Alliance, we have another team working on getting a piece of cargo up in the third level. 15 seconds left in the match, 2056. Looks like they are lining up for a level three climb. They are nearly up and they've got it. 1501 also has a level three climb, but they're gonna try a double climb with 401 and 1501. They've got it for the Blue Alliance. That's the first time we've seen that here on the Curie Field and knowing the teams that we have in this dance with a score of 85 to 72. Red Alliance was able to earn all four ranking points available to them. That bumps them up to the seventh, eighth, and ninth positions. Meanwhile, the Blue Alliance earned a 